I'm Brittany George. I'm here with the James Stewart. We're back at the track. How are you feeling? Uh, I'm all right. I'm just happy to be here. You know, uh, the fans seem really cool and uh, the track looks pretty good. I'm just, uh, unfortunately, I'm still recovering from, you know, a few crashes I had and then, you know, with last weekend, but I'm just out here having a good time. All right. I don't want to go back to the whole, you know, the incident or the crashes, but I'm wondering how you re how would you recover from something like that? How do you feel after the race? <laughs> or after the crash, I say. Yeah, pretty much after the crash. I didn't get to make the race last weekend. Um, I, I'm just really sore, you know. Um, you know, I hurt my hand. I thought I broke my hand, and um, you know, next race, X rays was negative. But it's it's cool, you know. Like I said, I'm out here for the fans and my team because you know I missed last year being here. So I, I just want to show up for these guys. Also talking about the fans, you know, you have a huge, strong fan base, and they're glad to see you back out here. And no matter what happens, you always have the fans behind you. Yeah, I mean, that's that's what's really important to me. You know, this season is kind of shot for me, so really all I can do is just, you know, make sure I get their money's worth, you know, just show up here, and uh, they like to see me ride. I'll be here, so uh, I'm, I'm here for these guys and uh, just see what happens this weekend. Now, after the race, were you able to, were you able to go home and uh, slightly recover, and what did you have to do to get ready for Colorado? I mean, pretty much, you know, after the race, uh, I just went home and, and, and hung out, you know, it was really nothing I could do. You know, I could barely walk the next day. And then, you know, my hand, of course, was really sore. So um, I didn't really do too much. Uh, unfortunately, you know, it's really nothing I can do in that incident. But we're back out here on the track and obviously you're looking like you're ready to go. And we know you can tough it out and you'll be able to go out there, cut some laps and hopefully another great race to add in the books. Yeah, I mean, I think for me right now, just to, to be out here and, and just the ride is, is, is fine to me. I don't really care what place I finish, just as long as these guys get to see me ride and, and everything. But there's one question I wanted to ask you, and uh, what is the third butt cheek? <laughs> I think uh, I think we have Don probably uh, snuck that one off to you to ask me about that, right? Yeah, but I, I want to know. He brought it up. <laughs> I want to know myself. I know. It, it kind of doesn't sound very good, but I guess um, if you've noticed in some of the pictures, maybe you'll be able to point it, and we'll be, maybe I can point it out to you. But now, now everybody knows about it. Now everyone knows. I'll be looking Thanks. then. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the interview, and obviously we wish you the best of luck. Hopefully you get back out there strong. I will. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, Don. <laughs>